At the end of six months, you should go to Crazy 8's palace with the best product you can make. If Crazy 8 finds out you're not a good cook, you will be taken by his posse who will cut your head off as a warning to other presumptuous meth cooks. If you're not found out, you shall have a present of two million dollars to start a life off as a drug lord. You see this child with his subpar product, the product that will keep him in the gutter to the end of his days. Well, in three months, I could pass that boy off as a perfect meth cook. I could even get him a place as his own cook, which requires a better recipe. And on the profits of it, I do scientific work in chemistry, and a little as a chemistry teacher. Well, Jesse, now's for it. Are you ready? You nervous, Mr. White? Frightfully. I feel exactly as I feel before my first major cook. It's the first time the frightens. It's not the first time for me, Mr. White. I've done this 50 times, hundreds of times in my head. It's like I'm in a dream now. Promise not to wake me, because if you do, I'll forget everything you taught me and cook like I used to. I love you, Jesse. Will you marry me? Yes. Let's go. Oh my god! You gotta try that. Ah! Uh. 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 Here you are at last, Crazy Eight. Have you found out all about the Tankman boy? Yes. I found out all about him. He is a fraud. A fraud? Oh no. Yes. He cannot deceive me. His name cannot be Pinkman. Why? Because Pinkman is a silly name. And he is not silly at all. Oh, nonsense. He cooks meth perfectly. Too perfectly. In fact, can you show me any meth cook who cooks meth? As it should be cooked. Only a chemist can do so. You're an ungrateful, wicked child. This is my return for offering to take you out of the gutter and teach you my recipe? Yo, Mr. White, that was deep. I'm inspired, okay? You can end it now, that- 